SP Falcons out car. I'm here with Tyler Spear after an impressive 6-0 home win over St. Martins. Tyler, your thoughts on the win? It was a great team win. Honestly, we uh, coach told us to go out and just be businesslike in our performance, and uh, we came out, got a lot of goals, got kept the shot out as well, which was super nice. It was a great team performance. Super happy we got the win. Sure was. Got an early goal in the ninth minute. Alex Mejia. Kind of an odd play. Uh, looked like the keeper trying to shield the ball at the goal line. What do you remember seeing on that? Yeah, that honestly, it was kind of strange. The ball just kind of popped out down there, and keeper's trying to shield it. Alex did a great job of just hustling, trying to get after the ball. Um, he got to it, took a touch inside, really good job, really good composure, and put it away, which was nice. That was very nice. That was his first goal. His second goal, uh, less than... Um, Less than three minutes later, you played a part in. Tell us what happened on that second goal. Yeah, I think ball was kind of in the middle a little bit. They had it. Um, kind of, I think, took a deflection a little bit. I was able to pick it up in the midfield. Um, and I saw Alex posting up the defender, and I knew as soon as that happened, I was going to play him the ball. Played him the ball. He spun out, which was super great, and just class finish from him. Right foot, right into the side netting. It was great. Certainly was. 22 yards out from the goal. Uh, when you're making that pass, are you thinking he may try and shoot from there? What is what is your objective on that pass? Yeah, honestly, as soon as he took his touch and he spun the defender, I knew he was going to shoot. Uh, I tried to cross the box as well just in case something happened, but knowing Alex, it's going in, so it was great. great. Well, you picked up a second assist on the team's third goal, 24th minute. Ald Massey scored a corner kick by you. Tell us uh, what went on. Yeah, uh, before the game, coach told us to stay bright on set pieces, meaning just play quick if we can. And Alden kind of gave me a little point to his left foot, and I knew it was on to play short. And uh, I just played it quick, low, across the box. I knew Alden was going to come in and strike it, and he had a great finish for sure. Alden's been on a scoring tear lately. Uh, in several consecutive games, he's had a goal. Uh, why has he been so effective? Alden's great. He uh, he really puts it puts the work in. Honestly, he uh, he gets at his defenders really well, and he just has an eye for the goal. Honestly, as soon as he gets in the box area, he's just lethal, and he is absolutely clinical when he gets his chances. So it's been great. Well, Alden would lead the team in scoring were it not for Alex Mejia, who uh, got a third goal, clinched the first team's first hat trick since 2018. Um, a pass from Mick Ryerson. It was a, a header on that play. Alex got 11 goals now in 10 games, uh, over a goal a game. What is the key to his uh, scoring production? Alex is great. He uh, he just he really knows where to be. Um, I think his positioning is just so great, and guys know it too. So we're just trying to feed him the ball and get him in the right spots. And as soon as he gets his chance, he normally finishes it, finishes it, and puts it away. Um, it's just been absolutely great to have a guy like that in our team. Great. Then the team finishes off with two uh, somewhat late goals. i got to let you give a couple props to those teammates. Judah Johnson scores for the second straight game. Talk about Judah. Absolutely. Judah, also a class player, um, gets in the box really well. Also a great player uh, in the wide areas. Um, if I remember correctly, he got in on a cross. Uh, Mejia couldn't quite finish that one, but Judah was there to put it away, which was awesome. He was there, right place, right time, which is great. And then right before talking to you, you were walking off the field with Joey Van Horn. He scored the, scored the team's sixth goal. Uh, what did you see on Joey's play? Yeah, it was interesting. Balls kind of just bounced around in the box. I think Keeper kind of mishandled it a bit, and Joey's there to tap it in. I think that's his first SPU goal, which is great. Great to get his first goal. It certainly was. How, how much... Do coaches get on you guys about following up shots uh, for that very reason? Absolutely, yeah. Anytime we get in the box, we're just looking to put bodies in there and just staying active, just looking for second balls, third balls, whatever. Uh, whenever it's in the box, expect it. Expect that it's coming to you and just be clinical when you get the chance. Great. Well, a lot of great individual things. The most important thing is the team improved to 9-1. and one. You're now still perfect 3-0 and oh in GNAC play. Uh, just talk about, you know, preserving that uh, perfect GNAC record and now having to hit, take that on the road. Yeah, absolutely. It's great to get three wins, obviously, um, all at home so far, which is good. We've kept our home turf safe. Um, getting out on the road will be fun. It'll be a challenge, but the guys are ready. We just got to stay active and just keep going. Just keep putting the foot down and don't let any, any teams breathe for sure. And I think we'll keep going. Great. Well, Tyler, thank you so much for your time. Congratulations on the two assists and the team victory. Thank you. Appreciate it.